Hello everyone, welcome to particular playthrough in this particular and we are back with some Age of Empires 4 in the new DLC. I am playing Japanese in the map Rocky River against uh, Dang89 who is also playing Japanese. So this will be a live game and this is one of my placement matches like, like the final one. So let's see how it goes. I have been playing the Japanese uh, for some time now and I have been doing pretty well. I have won 3 out of my four placement games and, well let's send the scout out to get some sheep first and then take from there so uh, what i like to do is uh, samurai and obligation rush so let's build a house here and let's send the next villager to let's so, uh, for those who don't know, at this point, I think most people know what the Japanese is all about. They are about their infantry and uh, economy, most of the cases. Well, uh, I'll explain it a bit. Uh, so, they mostly have these uh, buildings which serve multiple purposes, such as uh, farmhouses, which are both houses and uh, mills in the same building. And then we have the... What do you call them? The forges, which are the blacksmith and the mining capital. And we have our opponent scout here. So they are uh, trying to scout out my base. And we have two on gold. And next we'll send on uh, some on uh, stone. Because the Japanese has this special bonus called the silver mining. Where they can get uh, gold from mining stone. I think it's a 10% bonus. Uh, uh, and we have our villager here, and we did another mining camp uh, on the forge here, so that's that. And we have uh, 3 or 5 sheep, continue producing villager, always. And 2 on stone, and I will get some on board because Japanese units are pretty gold heavy. Do we have normal units such as the uh, spearmen? But then there is your main unit which is a samurai and a bagatia which costs gold. So I like to get some gold and let this first upgrade the, on the blacksmith which is known as Takara which gives us a plus one which is pretty important for some early aggression. There's some good amount of sheep I'll go back and drop this off first and then we will look for our opponent's uh, town center a bit of gap here in the village production and how long before we can age up we are pretty close to aging up actually let's drop the sheep off here and we can age up now I will go with the Kura storehouse. The Kura storehouse is a landmark that gives you rice fields or farms. A little bit late age to, to add placement of the Kura storehouse. So I put one gap between the Kura storehouse so it can produce the farmhouses around the, the town center here. And I think we have enough on gold now. And next, I would like to get some wood here. Because we do need barracks. But we have one less on food. Let's put one on food first. Uh, I think I put seven on food instead of me. Uh, some is still there. Anyways, does not matter. And we should be able to get our Tatar upgrade right now. Yes, we are able to get our Tatar upgrade. So we need another house here. So eight on that. Let's start our build order a bit here uh, due to the villager numbers. I think it's going to be finished. So I can. Oh, 
So what the diamond manor does is it builds another villager. Where is my other villager? Yoki Kana. Oh yeah, there it is. Most on our farm. And our good. Good. Yeah, I've also gone up with the Kurats house. Let's try to check out what time of uh, what they're building. They're, in, they're going double down side, so it's a good to go full aggression against him. Because he will be going up with people, so he will have less military. So let's get a here. A bit late on my timing. By this time, I generally like to have a bag out at least. Uh, but well, I have been. Playing much actually, and let's get our second person upgrade, and then we'll gradually start getting the rest of the upgrades. Here. And can we build a of that? And now we can build a barrack out here, and we are being scouted. So that's not really good, but well. And then. Ikana And I think we can build a house now, right? Yes, we can. And let's build some samurai. And we have a banner that Okay, the scout is standing right there. Okay, it does not matter for now. I hope they are doing. I hope that they don't build up any more And we need some more houses. And another barrack And that should be the start of our aggression And then drop the sheep off Uh, too many villages there Let's get the economic upgrades Let's get double plot at so the Kura Storehouse can act as a universal drop of point. So let's go and scout our house. Uh, the Kura Storehouse acts as a universal drop of point. And, uh, it can also act as a universal center for all the economic upgrades, which is really nice. Uh, so let's get our armor, all the upgrades. And now we are starting to build a pretty good mass of military. The Arbagasia out there. And build some more 
Rolling up, then we have an answer to that. And we should have a pretty good force. There's some other techniques, and I think we should start on the house. Okay, here we are. And we can go for the diamond pirates. Beach! Okay. They are bad. Sleep. So they are also uh, going for the samurai. So we'll just get one score. And let's continue building our Samurai bus. Samurai application bus. Okay. Can we get we can't do much later. And yeah, house. House. Get the mining upgrade. Moshi. Game up here. Okay. So if you have a good mask, we will just start moving towards the uh, base. And we will start moving towards the base. Where is the attack on my mask? Okay, they are going for an attack on my mask. So my samurai will pick up the map here. Or we can do a counter date actually. Okay, I'll just build a few of these. You guys can go destroy that and start doing this. Let's see. Last Let's <laughs> go. 
Go come here. That's just not good. Okay, that's not good. ぞえと Start building our army. I think they are attacking a scout. They put it some. Food out here. Bit long distance mining over here. すぐにラクテイトならん。一度ゲージマックのみ。狙い撃った。九千のもの。ゲージマックのみ。九千のもの。ゲージ先 
励むまでまさに造営の最中。を果たすところ皆の衆一度よく徳座に相いつますべし一度よく聞け皆一度よく聞け徳座に相いつますべし That should be able to sustain that. Is the Kuni Mukaubekia? Look at the that there and the Kuni Mukaubekia. And drop another on me. That's a decent loss of stamina, guys. He's getting on well. I'm going to be out of that. Okay, let's see any other updates. Okay, they also need some passages. It's not good. But now I can read Pidge we need some catapults to deal with that. And we need more houses. Oh god, we have another one. Okay. Done. Okay, and once that is done, we can have some catapults. That is almost done. Let's some bombs. Okay, that is done, so let's get there on that very Let's get two magnets on now. まさに良い励むまで。恩方のため見事な造営となりもうしそうろう。いかにいたすべきや。今後松田。Okay, Go ahead and drop it. Okay, go faster. 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 And now let's just follow it. Okay, we should have a bit of damage right now, too. I need more houses. Okay, let's build some buildings. Yes. 
with the placements so let's see where we get placed we can't i can't fight that bannerman boosted army at my current economy i am lacking gold now i am good at food but i guess it was a good fight uh, the first attack on the navigation raid was uh, pretty substantial and there's uh, something to learn I think the Anubagashia might be a better raiding unit first uh, instead of the Samurai direct attack and so first you raid with Anubagashia then you attack the Samurai so we get uh, placed in Silver 2. Let's uh, look at the timeline. Yeah, that unit count increase. Our unit count are mostly similar. Uh, let's look at the military count. Yeah, our military count and unit count are mostly similar but then the attack here and we kind of got rid of my military when I attacked them. So, yeah. Not building enough military costed me. Well, I guess that's it for today. And thank you for being here. I will see you guys next time with more Age of Empires 4. Have a good day. Thank you.